Tonight, getting kids moving to fight obesity at school. A local doctor came up with a program that's earning praise nationwide, and it's already a hit with students in Boston. Paula Eben shows us why in today's Eye on Education. It's just been a pleasure to see the kids so early in the morning uh, walking with me and with each other and with the teachers. At the Josiah Quincy School in Boston. It's, it's fun because we get to talk with our friends in the morning yeah. every day. Every school day begins with a 15-minute walk. If you're going to tell other kids at other schools how it's been this year, what would you say? It's been fun because at the beginning of the day, you get to talk to your friends, a lot of energy and stuff. Every small step gets the kids closer to their goal of 100,000 miles. I would like you to give yourself a round of applause for what you've been doing so far. First year gym teacher Tom Levitt joined the billion mile race led by New Balance and Tufts University to get kids moving at U.S. schools until they collectively reach a billion miles. He says kids and teachers alike have hit their stride. It just brings out that, you know, positive energy and to get that healthy habit starting right away in the morning. We would love all schools in Massachusetts to be part of this. Dr. Christina Economos of Tufts says Massachusetts has seen some improvement in childhood obesity rates for some two to six year olds. The Billion Mile Race is a competition designed to target elementary age kids. 4,500 schools have enrolled and they've already logged 25 million miles. You want to get kids excited just about moving. Right, overall, exactly, throughout the day and for the rest of their lives. Their favorite part of the day, and the best part is it's easy and it's free. If you'd like to get your school involved, just go to cbsboston.com. We have all the information there. And if you have an Ion Education story for us, email us at ioneducation at cbs.com or tweet me at Paula Eben WBZ.